Hello, so today me and Aslan are going to take you on a little tour of London's best cheap fried chicken. We're currently in the heart of Shoreditch, just around the corner from our first location, which is Mother Clucker. We're also extremely hungry. Yes. I feel like we haven't eaten since like 8am, so we're going to get some food in us. Let's go. So we're actually just off Brick Lane, which is arguably the original hipster place in London. It is definitely more the kind of like gourmet side. Yeah, it's not too expensive, but it's definitely like a nice upmarket street food. Thank you so much. So we've got the food. We went with the combo, the classic, which is three strips and is it, are they Cajun? Uh, Cajun fries, yeah, I think. Three strips and Cajun fries and a drink. And that came in at nine pounds, I yeah. think. Plus we got uh, a mango Rubicon as the drink. I feel like this is a very UK thing. Okay, should we dig in? I guess I always look for like three things with fried chicken. Is like the crunchiness of the batter. It's pretty crunchy in certain places, it's pretty good. Number two is the flavor of the actual seasoning on top. This isn't too spicy, a good amount of flavor. And then the third thing is like the juiciness of the chicken, which I think a mother clucker, this is the thing that impressed me the most all the time. Their chicken's always like super juicy in the mm. center. Fries, they're not outstanding, but they're like everything you'd want from like a, a classic fry. It's a great place to start if you're like, if you want to try a more yeah. gourmet like fried chicken. And it's easy, it strips, there's no bones, yeah. and it's just grab, go, and enjoy. So we're location number two. This place is called Butchie's. This has been very popular recently. So the focus here is not the chicken burger, but the chicken sandwich. So this place is opened by uh, a man and wife who used to go to New York all the time and they used to love the kind of the American chicken sandwich they used to get. Um, it's really a burger. I don't know what the definition yeah, to I mean, the chicken burger and sandwich is. If you're British, it's still a burger. Okay, I feel like we're gonna sandwich. start with a burger. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you go, you go first. So you, okay. you take that big juicy bite. It's a big, a big crunchy. Okay, wow. It's, it's a big boy sandwich. It like, it feels weighty in the hand. There's like a lot of weight to this. Mmm. That is phenomenal. That's really good. Yeah. The bun is super soft. It's really, really juicy in yeah. the center. It really is like a proper homage to the American chicken sandwich. Okay, yeah, two wings. Go buffalo. Wow, that is very juicy. Okay, so I would say this is probably arguably one of my favorite buffalo sauces I've ever had in my life because the vinegar content in this buffalo sauce is really low. Okay, here comes the award winning. Wow, it's a really different taste. Definitely a very Asian inspired flavor situation going on here. We saw when they were plating it up, they don't put on the sauce until like the last second of the process so when like from the sauce to it being served to you was probably like 10-15 seconds so it still retains that crunch. So. Well I guess let's go to the other place but yeah. before we go I mean I can't help you. Okay yeah you gotta, we're gonna finish off the burger. We are here at Bird which is probably London's first gourmet fried chicken place I think. You think so? I think it was. When I think of fancy buffalo wings I think of Bird because they do them well. All right the wings are here, I can't wait to get stuck in. So we got like six classic wings, they're buffalo style. I think it's worth saying that they actually have 12 different sauces. It's good. Much more like kind of classic buffalo sauce than was it butchies. The crunch levels, really nice. Yeah. Really nice and crunchy. Why come to Bird more than any other place? I think if you're looking for chicken wings and more classic like buffalo wings and also loads of sauces that might please everybody. We are on our penultimate location. We've moved a little bit more center into town. We're in an area called Bloomsbury. Not only have we moved geographically, we've also moved cuisines, because this place is called Wing Wing, and it's a Korean place. We're gonna experience a slightly different take on fried chicken. We made our order. We got two different things. So the first thing we got was six wings, which we got as a mix. So it's too hot two soy and garlic and two licorice. And we also got two katsu chicken bowls. Interestingly, not much of like a sauce, more of like a very small amount of glaze on the wings. Oh yeah, this is like, the crisp is amazing. The crunch on the skin is phenomenal. I love that. Oh damn, this bao, the outside is so crispy. Heavy on the mayo. I think the only downside to me, this is my third one. Uh -huh. They could have all been the same flavor. <laughs> like, it all tastes nice. It's just like, they're not as distinctive as you might. Very true. 
imagine. Um, I live, I live for the crunch. Okay, so here we are at our final destination. And to me, this is the true essence of fried chicken in London. Let's say you've been to the pub with your friends. Okay. Hypothetically you've, speaking, of course. Yeah, hypothetically. You know, you've had a couple of pints, you're feeling hungry afterwards. Where do you go? Of course, you go to Morley's or any other cheap fried chicken place. There's PFC, perfectly fried chicken, AFC, American fried chicken. This is what fried chicken is about in London. So if you ever come to London, you have to try like a cheap chicken place. And when I say cheap, I mean cheap. Normally you get like six chicken wings and chips, right? It'll be about £2.49. Not as ethical. Definitely not gonna be your free range chicken, that's for sure. So the biggest problem with like chicken shops is that they normally batch frying like a hundred or something wings and they keep them under a heater. So they sacrifice a lot of the crunch. We've dined at five different places, I believe. Mm -hmm. Why not pick our favorite now? No shame, no diss on any of the other places. We all know what the favorite is. It was Butchie's. Oh, that was, was so good. That chicken sandwich of Butchie's was incredible. Like it's, it actually delivers the promise of an American style chicken sandwich. It, it was head and shoulders above the rest, if I'm honest. Yeah. That would be my top tip. Hmm. Uh, if you come definitely to London, definitely give Butchie's a go. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Let us know what you think about this type of content. Subscribe and, and of comment. The chicken, of course. What? I meant of the chicken. Oh, right? okay. Yeah, yeah. Let us know, and let us know what you think of the video, of course. Okay. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave a comment and buy the merch. We have no merch. There we is no merch. merch. <laughs> There's no merch. Yet. Yeah. I feel like we should get, get a wing. We should this this will be our this will be our cheers outro. Cheers. Cheers.